right, we're going to solve this using the quotient rule and the chain rule. So starting off, g prime of y is going to be equal to, um, so the derivative on top is going to be, let's see here, 4y minus 1 raised to the third, and then derivative on the inside is just 1, fortunately. And then um, y squared plus 2y raised to the fifth, and then um, minus, so we get y minus 1 raised to the fourth, and then uh, deriv derivative on the bottom, 1, so times 5, and then derivative on the inside is going to be 2y plus 2, and then uh, finally y squared plus 2y raised to the fourth. And then all of this over y squared plus 2y square that, but that ends up being um, raised to the tenth. Let's see, so breaking this down further. <laughs> um, huh. Well, that's pretty much where it is right now. That's technically fine. Um, I'm trying to think if there's anything specifically. You can probably just leave it like this. It's a little bit laborious to break it down more, but just if you write this, this is technically correct, though, and we'll leave it like that. Okay.